I am Dulcie Hill, and I've recently told you guys that I've been using uh, Sydney's 30-minute uh, upper body workout, but I've been substituting some of my own exercises that I used to do my own class, body sculpting class. So what I'm going to do is show you a bunch of different exercises that you can substitute uh, when you follow her workout there. She's just got an incredible upper body workout there. Uh, and, and if you're disabled and you're not able to balance or anything, it's really good. So I'm going to show you these exercises there. First of all, let me turn this to the chair. Okay, now Sydney does, she starts out with her uh, shoulder workout. Uh, I'm going to show you a sculpting exercise. Uh, Alright, a sculpting exercise. Uh, she starts off with, uh, um, let me see, I, I believe like uh, uh, the, the arm raises. And then she goes on to, you know, the upright rows. That is great. And then she does the front raises there. Instead of doing the front raise, if you can do your palms up, and I'm going to turn sideways there, your shoulders back and your elbows out, and then you press up and then down. That really targets that front uh, deltoid muscle there. So up and down and up and down. Now, at no point do you want your weight over your elbows. They have to be out a bit, shoulders back, chest up. Um, pretend like you're pinching your shoulder, you're pinching a pencil between your shoulder blades. So you press up, okay, up, and then. So that's one exercise that you can substitute with your shoulders. Uh, another exercise, it combines the uh, abdominals too is uh, you go left and right and then forward and forward left right forward forward left right forward forward left hold your stomach in really tight when you do that so that's the second exercise there um, the third exercise that I want to show you is she does bicep curls like this. Now I want to show you, if you bring your elbows in, lift with your pinky. Uh, there's two different types of bicep curls. One word bicep meaning two different muscles, bi, right? One works the inside bicep muscle there and one works the outside. When you do wide bicep curls, really wide, that works the inside. So this is one type of bicep curl, and the other is with your palms, or with the hammer curls that works the outside. And then you pull it up. Again, I'm gonna show you that when you're doing this, you never have your arms down. Your arms have to be out in front, shoulders back, all right? This is the starting position, ending position. Notice I don't bring it all the way up where it's resting down and up down and up all right hammer curls right um she does uh she lays on the floor and i know it's difficult for some of us skull crushers right and she does with two two weights you can see this left arm is painted on that's really really difficult now i show you um, with the band and it's better with the band if you do skull crushers run it underneath your fanny there and then you can you can with your hands together push up all right there's two different if you're laying on the floor right you hit pause you get on the floor or get on your couch or get on the bed there there's two different types palms facing up and then the other type is palms facing together, down. And then you want your elbows to be close up against your ears there. And again, they're a sculpting exercise. It works two different, oh, oh, 
I'm not doing it. <laughs> My fork is awful. But anyway, you've got to hold your stomach in and, and keep that in. So they're, they're the two big things there. The uh, other thing is that all right, she does the bro. And I like I like her bro. I do like her bro and then her wide bro. All right. And it's good to have a mirror. Remember keep your shoulder blades back. That's important that I want to tell you. There um also uh let's see. She talks about keeping the weights in and doing this. That's a good exercise there. It's uh, hard to do. It's hard for, if we have MS and you have difficulties, so you can take one weight and press it. Press your hands together there, all right? Take one weight. It's not so much the lifting of the weight. It's, it's do you remember Judy Bloom? We must, we must, we must. So you're, you're getting your chest to compress there. So I want to show you that. That is the other thing. She, uh, she shows push-ups there on the ground. Is I, I love that, but it's very difficult, especially when you have spasticity. I couldn't do it because I kept jerking out. Um, so I want you to, to be aware that you can use your, your uh, walker, you can use your chair, um, I used uh, a chair, real wide, and then you go down. All right, I'm not, I'm not showing you. So you do, you do that. The other tricep that you can do, all right, is assisted dips. There. Down. Assist, keep your shoulders back. And you don't want to go all the way down, all right? See, I've got a lot of the weight off of my, my legs. The stronger you are, the more you put your feet out, all right? And you dips. So there are some exercises that you can substitute. Uh, write it down and design your own workout there. Don't, I love, I love that. Oh, excuse me. I love that she touches your, her legs often. So do that with the weight there, and that's a, um, uh, a uh, hamstring workout. It's really good for us because our hamstrings tend to be weak there. Uh, also, if you go down my exercise video stuff, you'll see uh, lunges. I show you how to do lunges. I'm not gonna show you that because I'm just showing you things that you can substitute in her workout, she, uh, different exercise there. Uh, let's see, things that, that, that I've been doing there. And, and uh, again, I have her video on my exercise video blog. I love this. I love her. I, I do. I, I sent that around to all, of, all the healthy people I know. So I want you to please subscribe to my video channel again on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Uh, we go live and it's MS support. It's like a, a support forum there and, and I answer questions. I've had MS for 34 years. Uh, those of you who are used to seeing my face, I love you. Uh, please subscribe. I pray for you all. God bless you and keep coming back. Go to msfrontiers.org and look at the resources we have for you. And again, on Facebook, we have a number.